Now to a story that's positively Utah. Some local kids are basically trying to memorize the dictionary as they prepare for the Scripps National Spelling Bee. Yeah, I sat down with one 11 year old contestant whose personality is as big as the trough of words he already knows. You are correct. You are correct. You are correct. Spelling has brought me all this way to be on TV, so you kind of have to like it. <laughs> Being on TV is pretty cool. This is your first time, right? Yep. What do you think? It's pretty ner nervous and fun at the same time. You gonna tell your friends? Yeah, for sure. Already, have you? Like... Yeah, they already know. I have no idea how to pronounce it, so I'm gonna let the pronouncer say it. Okay. Imarit. Imarit. I M A R E T. Imarit. That is correct. Thank you. And let's do this one. I don't know how to say it either. I'm gonna guess. Okay, this will. I'm gonna say in choked. And then we'll find out. Inchoate. Are you kidding? Inchoate. Oh, inchoate. <laughs> I N C H O A T E. Inchoate. Yes. <laughs> Thank you. Brilliant. I'm going to guess on this one too. Ren Minbi. Ren Minbi? Correct. Ren Minbi. R E N M I N B I. Ren Minbi. You are 100%. <laughs> Thank you. Well, I'm feeling prepared, but it's, it's not what I feel, it's how I do. To be honest, when studying for the regionals, I studied quite a lot, but I don't think it was enough. Now that I passed the regionals, I've been studying almost every day for at least two and a half hours. Oh my gosh, that's a lot of words. Well, people do a lot more than me. Really? But, yeah, some people do six to seven. I just wanna give myself the best chance I can. So I study roots, spellings, definitions. I just need to learn, I wanna learn that 4,000 words package back and forth. You wanna go all the way, obviously, not just this next round. You wanna go to the National Spelling Bee. Yeah, but considering this is my first year, I'm so deciding to set small goals. So first, my first goal is to make it to quarters, then quarters to semis, semis to finals. How cute is that I kid? want him to win the whole thing. <laughs> I <Seriously>. love him. <laughs> He's he great. the but, cutest. Uh, I really enjoyed meeting all the kids from Utah, and I wish them all luck. So they were great. Thank you for sharing your stories with us. Virtual rounds start tomorrow, and then the top 10 to 12 spellers will move on to the in-person finals, which are July 8th. You know, that's, that's also going to be at uh, ESPN's Wide World of Sports Complex at Walt Disney World Resort. So they're going big time here. Yeah. I've really enjoyed these, you know, so nice job. Oh, they were great. It's all the great kids. Great kids. I know, I know. <laughs> they it's were this, it's awesome. this kid too. It's yeah. fun to watch. Yeah.